Hi friends, it's Wendy with H2O Bungalow. I'm so excited you're here today. Today I'm going to share with you my newest project. I made an entire set of DIY coastal style tiki torches for our backyard and I made them all for less than it would have cost me to buy one of the fancy ones I found online. As always guys, you'll find all the products I used and links to all my supplies in my blog post at h2obungalow.com, search Tiki Torch. And while you're there, don't forget to subscribe. And of course, subscribe to my YouTube channel too. Just push that subscribe button below. I used 16 ounce glass jars with mason style lids for this project. I made the glass jars look like sea glass with a coat of Krylon Sea Foam spray paint. While my glass jars were drying, I worked on my metal top. Either mark the center or eyeball it, use a drill, and make a pilot hole. Use needle nose pliers and pry the edges of your opening back just a little bit until you can fit your half inch coupling in snugly. You're not going to want any extra space. I used heat resistant paint to spray both the lid tops and the couplings, let them dry and then reassemble them. Next I added decorative trim with jute twine, driftwood, and small seashells. I held them in place with a dab of hot glue. The twine will stay in place much better if you put a tiny dab of hot glue on the front and back of the jar and then wind the twine directly over top of it. I tied the driftwood on with a little knot and secured it with a dab of glue. To hold the seashells securely in place, I tied a knot at the end of the string, filled the shell with glue, and pushed the knot into the wet hot glue. Last, you'll assemble your lid, you'll add the tiki fuel, and trim the wick to about one half inch to three quarters. You'll find that this works terrific in the breeze, it repels bugs really well, and it's beautiful. It's a great alternative to expensive tiki lamps you'll find in the stores.